Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you saw my last video, you'll see that I began to build my own website. It offers endless opportunities to create a website that's personal to you, and I'll be developing mine more in the rest of the video. Hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing a study with me if you couldn't already tell i've got a lot to do a lot to do i've got mocks after this half term's over and it's already thursday i need to get my act together because i've not done nearly as much as i should have i've just spent a lot of the time relaxing and which obviously is also a massive important factor but i do really need to get on doing some stuff what i'm going to be doing today ignore my throat my voice is literally i'm losing it don't know why don't know how so i hope this video gives you a little dash of motivation i haven't filmed a study with me in quite a long time now so hopefully hopefully it will help you so to begin with i'm gonna work on some history i want to try and plan some essay answers as some revision Phone on do not disturb as you just saw and I'm gonna get started now I also forgot to mention if you didn't know already and if you do live outside the UK mocks are basically exams that students take before their real exams um, we basically just do questions similar to the real ones I'm sure that a lot of people will have these sort of tests but yeah if you live in the UK and are doing A-levels or GCSEs, you will know that recently a lot of advanced information got released. Um, obviously, it's been quite a tough year and last year as well, so they decided to give out some extra information that's going to be on our real exams. It really depends on what subjects you take them and what exam boards you are studying because some subjects like biology, nothing drastically changed. They basically just did a ranking system um, from the specification. Though, whereas history, you know, there's been more taken out from there. And the specification, some topics have been removed and the ones that have been left in are the ones that we need to solidly revise because they are the ones that are going to show up on the exam. Don't get me wrong, you still need to know literally everything because you need to have that context, but it will be helpful. It's just started to absolutely chuck it down typical britain for you i've been working for like a solid 30 minutes now i think i'm gonna have a little break now go on my last video and reply to some comments because i do try to reply to as many as possible yeah if you haven't checked out my last video make sure to go and do that it's a reset morning routine basically getting my life together i'm also filming one of my little tiktoks wow really great so far we're looking really great so far um <laughs> cute behind the scenes of making a TikTok. I then decided to post a couple of pins on Pinterest. I really do need to upload quite a few more though because I've got so many that I haven't uploaded in so long, but feel free to follow my Pinterest. It's Louise, the same as this username. I then got back to making some history notes and as I was mentioning earlier about this advanced information I was going through that making sure that I had looked at all of the points on it. Just about to post the TikTok now, be sure to go and check that out if you would like to. <laughs> 
bless me. If you saw my last video, I started using Squarespace to build my own website. I personally don't have a business I'm using the application to create a place that you guys can visit to get yeah. motivation. It's very easy to use and there are so many different tools that you can use to just really make it your own. I've changed one of these sort of social links to videos now. Just put in three of my videos and directly underneath is a link to my YouTube channel. These are three of my photos that I've uploaded. Just put in a few quotes that I love relating to studying. I made an about page now. Just bring you into a page that looks like this. It's got a little bit of information about me. You could literally make a website about anything. Future, obviously I'm doing fine art at university, so you never know, I might make one. I begin to sell my paintings, I can use it for that. An art gallery little thing. There's so many options that you can use this website for. So yeah, definitely make sure to go and check out Squarespace and I'll leave a link in my description below. I've just had some crisps and I'm having a little snack. I'll probably get some more substantial lunch later. I'll probably get on with doing some history revision. Bit of a side story, but I'm literally always torn now because I really did love flashcards and making flashcards. With my computer now, it's just so much quicker to type stuff. And I feel like I'm always time wasting when I'm writing. But then also part of me is like, right, well maybe writing it down helps me remember it more. It's a, it's, I don't know how to describe it, but I have too many flashcards to let go to waste, so I will. It's coming up to my real exams, I will make some. I think for the minute I'm going to stick with typing because it's quicker and more time efficient, and that's really what I need at the minute. Okay, so I then decided to start to work on a specific section of one of the points on the spec. Also, as you can see on my laptop, that is my study 2022 playlist on Spotify. So if you are wanting to find some sort of good study beats to study to, obviously, you can feel free to check that out. My username is also Louise over there, but I'll definitely make sure to link the playlist down below in the description as well. And then I just began reading the page and highlighting any key information that was in the textbook. I then basically just started reading further articles and documents and anything sort of like that to widen my knowledge of the subject even more. And as I was doing this, I was keeping an eye out for any sort of key dates, key facts and really like important sentences that I could use in my essays as well. Yeah, so it's quite a little bit later now and I think I'm going to end the video here. I'm basically going to be carrying on doing the same thing after I've stopped filming. really hope this video was helpful to give you some motivation. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe down below. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!